Good evening, I'm Paul Fraser and this is the 7 o'clock news from Bahrain Television. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa received a cable of greetings from His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, on the advent of the new Hijri year 1438. In the cable, His Royal Highness the Premier conveyed his greetings to His Majesty the King, wishing him abundant health and happiness, and for him, the people of Bahrain, as well as for Arab and Islamic nations, many happy returns. In reply, His Majesty the King sent a cable to His Royal Highness the Premier, thanking him for his earlier cable and wishing his health and happiness, and for him, the Kingdom of Bahrain, as well as the Arab and Islamic nation, many happy returns. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa received a cable of greetings from His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander, First Deputy Premier, His Royal Highness Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, on the advent of the new Hijri year 1438. In the cable, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince conveyed his greetings to His Majesty the King, wishing him abundant health and happiness, and for him, the Kingdom of Bahrain, as well as for Arab and Islamic nations, many happy returns. In reply, His Majesty the King sent a cable to His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, thanking him for his earlier cable and wishing him health and happiness, and for him, the Kingdom of Bahrain, as well as the Arab and Islamic nation, many happy returns. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa exchanged cables of greetings marking the new Islamic year, that's Hijri year, of 1438 with the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Abdullah bin Abdulaziz Al Saud, the Kuwaiti Emir Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabbar Al Subah, President of the United Arab Emirates Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nahyan, Sultan Qaboos bin Rashid of Oman, and the Qatari Emir Sheikh Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani. His Majesty also exchanged cables of greetings with leaders of the Arab and Islamic countries. He wished the GCC, Arab and Islamic leaders continued health, happiness, progress and prosperity for their countries and peoples. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, received a cable of greetings from His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander, First Deputy Premier, His Highness Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, on the advent of the new Hijri year 1438. In the cable, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince conveyed his greetings to His Royal Highness the Premier, wishing him abundant health and happiness, and for him, the Kingdom of Bahrain, as well as for Arab and Islamic nations, many happy returns. In reply, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister sent a cable to His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, thanking him for his earlier cable and for his noble feelings and wishing him health and happiness. And for him, the Kingdom of Bahrain, as well as the Arab and Islamic nations, many happy returns. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, exchanged cables of greetings marking the new Islamic year, that's the Hijri year of 1438, with the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Abdullah bin Abdulaziz Al Saud, the Emir of Kuwait, Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabbar Al Subah, the President of the United Arab Emirates, Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nahyan, Sultan Qaboos bin Said of Oman, and the Qatari Emir, Sheikh Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani. His Royal Highness also exchanged cables of greetings with leaders and Prime Ministers of the Arab and Islamic countries. He wished the GCC Arab and Islamic leaders continued health, happiness and progress and prosperity for their countries and peoples. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, issued two edicts for the year 2016. Edict 47 amended some provisions of Edict 44 of 2011 concerning the establishment of the National Steering Committee for Biological Diversity. Edict 48 substituted, renewed the appointment and appointed members of the Consultative Committee of the National Cadre for Qualifications at the National Authority of Qualifications and Quality Assurance of Training and Education, the QAA. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa exchanged cables of greetings marking the new Islamic year of 1438 with the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Abdullah bin Abdulaziz Al Saud, the Emir of Kuwait, Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabbar Al Subah, the President of the United Arab Emirates, Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nahyan, Sultan Qaboos bin Said of Oman, and the Qatari Emir Sheikh Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani. 
Israel Highness also exchanged cables of greetings with leaders and crown princes of the Arab and Islamic countries. He wished the GCC Arab and Islamic leaders continued health, happiness and progress and prosperity for their countries and peoples. The personal representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sport and Head of Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamid Al Khalifa, sent a cable of congratulations to His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa on the occasion of being granted the Samuel Zwimmer Award by the Reformed Church in the United States and the Lifetime Achievement Award by the US C3 Summit. In the cable, His Highness Sheikh Nasser highlighted that such an award is a recognition of the continued efforts and achievements of His Majesty the King in various fields, including development, respect to religions and support for medical services, as well as consolidating relations between Bahrain and the United States of America at different levels. His Highness Sheikh Nasser added that granting His Majesty the King with these two awards affirms His Majesty's efforts and the accomplishments he made to the Kingdom of Bahrain in the various levels, which turned Bahrain into a model for development, an oasis of peace and a gathering place for all religions.